Alrighty guys, what's going on today? We're going to be using some Adam's Car Shampoo. Uh, this is the first time I've used this, so I'm going to shake it kind of good. Just to get everything flowing. Um, I'm not sure how much of this stuff to use, so I'm kind of just going to guess a little bit. Um, maybe not that much, yeah, that's probably fine. And then I'm just going to... probably some proper adjustments I should be making to this but oh well so let's go over here to the car and see how study this is and how good it looks so I want to say this stuff is pH balance as well which will be pretty nice because as you can see actually I don't know if you can see it or not but um, over there on the car it's actually pretty sunny so hopefully it'll keep it from uh, making a bunch of dry spots so I'll see you guys whenever we get back over there to the car all right, so hopefully my cord will somewhat reach, but um, I'll just move. Let's move to about here. Uh, the cord is not long. I think it's like six feet, so I'm going to try to keep it somewhat close. So if the video angle is kind of bad, sorry, but um, let's go ahead and put some of this soap onto the car. Let's see how it looks. Oh, wow. That is really sunny. So yeah, I think it should be pH balanced, uh, is what I've heard. So it should do all right here in the sun. Um, also, I you guys are probably gonna yell at me for this, but I don't have a second bucket. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna, um, after I'm done going for a little bit, I'm gonna just use this mitt and I'm just gonna wash it off really good with my uh, hose and hopefully get some of this stuff out. Scrub a little bit on some of these bugs. Yeah, this stuff actually works really good. Um, it smells kind of good too. I don't know. I'm not really like, I like it whenever it smells good, but like it's not gonna be a huge deal for me. So let's just go ahead and grab our hose and spray off a little bit. Kind of clean up. So yeah, I've always done this instead of using a rinse bucket. I don't know why, probably just because I don't have a rinse bucket. But uh, I don't know, I think it works just as good. Probably doesn't, but I mean, that could just all be in my head. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and move this over here. A little bit closer. So yeah, as you can tell, actually, I don't know if you can see or not uh, on the camera, but it's actually, it's really sunny. Um, smells pretty good. And uh, this is my first time using it, so we'll see. Um, over here on the side of the car, um, it's really dirty. So whenever we move over there, we'll go look at it and see how it does. All right, guys, so we're back at the back of the car now, and you can see all of this. Uh, it's pretty pretty good mud, just kicked up from the back of the uh, tire. So we're going to go ahead and clean all that off. I'm going to show you guys how it goes with the, uh, with the Adam's soap. So we're going to start up here. Easy. Super easy. Go ahead and leave that on there for a few minutes just to let it just to let it collect and do its thing. We're gonna move to the rest of the car. Start from the bottom and then work our way down. And get the side skirts really good. Side skirts where all of the all the dirt really takes up is right down here and then the back where all that was. So 
Definitely gotta make sure we get those parts good. But uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh, video.